bookshelf? Why does he have a bookshelf? Why do you have a bookshelf? It's not good enough, man. It is not good enough. I'm taking away your your podium. Oh shoot, it didn't work. <laughs> is this not your work block, sir? Is that not your work block? Oh, hi. You, you're not old enough to be here right now. Oh, hi everybody. <laughs> VP here, and it's time for another Minecraft Quest for Home. Sorry, you guys uh, caught me in the middle of a uh, yeah, little uh, remodeling here in our trade hall. Uh, I had a little few issues here um, with my traders and uh, trying to convert them, and a lot of my original traders died. So, uh, yeah, I've been bringing in new traders and opening it up because I have uh, people that aren't librarians or what are they called yeah librarians um, coming in here and taking beds so <laughs> rather than keep them closed off I decided to open it all up also so I could see which workstations belong to who generally if somebody is standing by a workstation uh, that is their workstation so this gentlemen here protection too this is this is not a good trade my friend this is not seat so let's get rid of this uh oh it might be too late it might be too late or it wasn't his workstation let's see there's a plain clothed guy right there let's see if I do this oh man I, I don't even know now I don't even know Jerry's still here, man. We got Jerry here. We got uh, any of the other guys survive. Uh, Charles. <laughs> Charles is still sticking around. Uh, Albert. And yeah. Yeah, so those are the only three. Those are the only three guys that I have left from my original crew. So uh, I've been coming back in here from time to time and uh, trying to, uh, to get this all sorted out. And it's, it's, it's just not working, man. It's just not working. But anyways, welcome to Minecraft Quest for Home. Uh, got a got a big episode here for you. I don't know if it's a big episode, but it's gonna be. Uh, we're gonna try to fit in a lot of stuff. So of course we did all this trading stuff here, and I'll come back to that eventually. Um, but what I really want to focus on today is out here um, at the iron farm. I want to get this decorated up a little bit. But rather than spend the whole episode, uh, you know, building onto this and decorating it, uh, basically turning the farm out here into a build is what I'm going to try to do. But uh, I don't want to spend all episode on it. So uh, we'll probably do like a... We'll probably go back and forth, really. We'll probably do some of that and some other stuff. I don't know exactly what yet, but uh, we'll figure it out. But for right now, i got to make my way out here, collect the materials that I need, and uh, yeah, and then we'll go from there. Alright, so uh, one of the first things I need to do out here is, uh, let's make this platform not be floating outside the water. <laughs> All right, it's just floating there right now. We need to, we need to, we need to bring some uh, some legs in here and make this turn it into an actual structure. So I'm gonna do that real quick, and uh, once I'm done with that, then we'll uh, start on the uh, the rest of the decoration. But let's get this sucker grounded first.
there we go. That's probably not going to be the final form for that, but uh, for now it works. <laughs> for now it works. At least now it doesn't look like uh, it's standing, you know, just floating in the air. <laughs> so that makes me feel better. We'll probably go through and uh, decorate that up a little bit more. I went with the uh, the 2x2 two two, uh, shape just because this thing is huge, right? So you're not going to have, like, small little legs on it you're gonna have like these huge legs so that's uh that's why we got the uh the uh the two by two uh here and uh next we'll probably move up here and uh kind of bring this up to uh to that if i can so i'm gonna do that real quick and then uh, i'll be right back with you all right guys got a little bit of uh work done here um getting the front portion of this iron farm built. Um, but I think I'm going to try to add a little extra something-something uh, before I start putting iron bars and stuff in like like we had in my creative world. I'm uh, still going to use that design, but I'm going to try something with a smooth stone. So if I go over here and go up the... Uh, this scaffolding here. I'm going to try a little design here. I don't know if it's going to work. Uh, I haven't tried it out, but uh, I'm just going to try to do like a little, just a little, little something here to maybe uh, just add a little more interest to it. Um, and I probably will need more scaffolding, so let me get some of that uh, attached to there. Okay. Yes, and then if I bring it out... Actually, let's uh, get rid of that, because I think I want to do this, and then bring it down one more. Uh, another piece of scaffolding. Scaffolding. Oh, boom. Well, it's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good thing I'm building over water, isn't it? <laughs> oh, man. Uh, that's, that's the... Uh, that's the good and the bad thing about uh, building right here is uh, there's water to fall into, but then uh, if you fall down, you have to climb all the way back up here. But uh, we did it. <laughs> we got back up here. Um, yeah, so, okay, uh, I was doing this. So I want uh, this and I think one more on this side here. If I can fit the scaffolding in here. See, the hard part with working with scaffolding up here is uh, you can't sneak. Because <laughs> my sneak button takes me down. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm just kind of winging this here. Okay. Something like that. I guess it's similar to the uh, the anchor we made at the sea shrine, But uh, I don't want it to be quite an anchor. And I don't want it to look like just like an arrow or something. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I wanted to add something to give just a little more interest. I don't know. Let's see what it looks like right now. Let's see what we got right now. Okay. Okay, cool. It doesn't quite look like an arrow. That is good. <laughs> uh, let me replicate what I did over there uh, on this side over here. So, uh... Yeah, let's get some scaffolding here. Uh, let me throw a uh, uh, another slab on here, and then make my way up. Oop, went a little bit further than last time. That's okay. All right, so we got the four right here, like that. Okay, and then coming off of this one, we have another one like that and coming off of this one and then we need to go down under <laughs> down under um oops i'm just adding to uh that there that's there we go i think it's a complete uh <laughs> scaffolding circuit now um one down like that i think four Wait, okay, wait a minute. Wait a second. Is it the same? Is it the same? Yes, okay, we got the four. Oh, maybe I need that right there. Okay. Yes, and then... 
Is that right? Let me let me get down and see. Let's get down here and see. You hear our iron? Our iron farm's working, man. I hear the I hear the uh the guys in there uh you know the iron golems getting ground up, <laughs> burned up. Uh yeah, I think that's it. Let's get rid of the scaffolding real quick. So we can kind of see what it looks like. Uh oop, I'm about to get in the water and grab my scaffolding. Okay, sweet. Yeah. Alright, let's see what it looks like. Let's see what that looks like. Okay. You know, it's not bad. That is not bad. I think I like that. I think I like that. Do I want to bring it out one more? Or is it good like that? Hmm. Hmm. I think... I think we'll leave it for now. And, uh... Yeah. And then uh, we'll see what we can do with it. Uh, but let me get my scaffolding here. Ugh, okay, I think I got that. And then a little bit that fell in the water here. Right like that. Okay, excellent. All right, so I guess we're going to move on to the uh, next portion of uh, this design. Which I think um, is just going to be like our iron bars. I gotta check my creative world again real quick and see how it was and then uh, when I get back from that we'll uh, we'll start cracking away at this man. It looks like I've strayed uh, from my original design already. Uh, the, the legs going into the water here were supposed to be fences, cobblestone fences. Um, but I think I'll leave it as is, and what I'm going to do now is I'll just go in and I'll throw some fence, some, or some cobblestone walls, rather, not fences, but the uh, cobblestone walls, um, and I'll throw those around the edges here a little bit. So let's see, if I go all the way up to this spot here, let's see, I'm at 80. Uh, it's a good thing I have my, uh, it's a good thing I got my, uh, <laughs> my coordinates up there in the top left corner. Cause then I can tell uh, which side, uh, you know, how high I am here. So building at 80, if I bring the scaffolding out a little bit so it gives me some room. If I do something like this at 80, and let's do, let's do, yeah, 79 and 80. If I do something like this, will it give me some kind of neat little kind of design here? I think it'll be cool. Yeah, and then what if I do that? Yeah, just like that. I don't know. This might not look good, guys. I'll have to check it out and see uh, eventually. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let's put two more right here. Because I think I want these little knuckle areas <laughs> all the way around. Oops. Ah! Oh, ow. No, that's okay. Um. So for now, let me... Uh, let's do this. I'm uh, going to use a, uh, a regular slab here. Uh, so monsters can't spawn. <laughs> I'll get rid of this portion once I'm done building the wall around. Okay, just like that. And then again, like so. And then I need to get around to the other side. So let's see if my scaffolding can take me around there without falling over. <laughs> so far, so good. Alright, and then... Can I get one more? Is it going to fall in? Let's see if it falls in the water. Ooh. Oh, no, still going. Still going good. So, do this, do that. How about one more? How about one more? Oh, still still good. Still good. Let's see. Can I, oops, can I stretch it out here? Nope, that's where all comes now this I think this falls all the way down through the water and then comes up I think I don't know we're gonna see otherwise I'm gonna see oops yeah otherwise we'll probably see a, <laughs> a lot of scaffolding uh, coming up through the water here okay cool there we go that's what we need because I just need to complete this all the way around like oops that was too low that one is too low. I need it on that one. Okay, let's see what that looks like. That is not that is not too bad. Yeah, I think I like that. I think I want to do three, though. 
I think I'm going to do three at that slot. So I want to put one more cobblestone wall underneath this one. I think that'll be pretty sweet. So actually, like right here, if I just bring this around, can I, can I cheat this and get some more? Oh, no, it's just going to build it higher. Uh... Uh, if I there that works I guess <laughs> I guess that works so yeah I just need to bring it down one more all the way across yeah so if I duplicate that over here and then on the back walls or the back legs um, and then maybe down here as well uh, I think that that might look pretty good so uh, well, let me do that, guys, and uh, when I get done with that, we'll see where we're at. All right, guys, here is my progress thus far. Um, I did punch out those, uh, those smooth stone blocks a little bit to bring it forward, and I highlighted it with just regular stone just to kind of even push it out even further. And then the knuckles... Uh, right there are all in now, and I also went ahead and put in our iron, uh, you know, fences right there. So they, they are in, and then the, uh, the stone brick, the stone brick is underneath and above it. I think it looks pretty cool. I think it looks pretty cool. I'm thinking now, I think I want to bring, like, maybe some... I don't know, like some sort of fence post design down here. Do I want two and two, or... Let's see. If I do a double wall here, maybe? Oh, let's see. Oop, nope, not that. Not that. Hey, hey. I need these right here. So then we'll do the... Yeah, a cobblestone. Let's do it one below that one. So like this, I think. Take it all the way across here. Whoops. Uh, uh, there. <laughs> and then... Maybe, maybe we do double it up here. Maybe we double that up there. And then bring the cobblestone wall down like so. And then we got the two right here. Okay, and then we'll put some iron bars in like so. I think... I think this will be okay? Question mark? <laughs> Okay, something like that, maybe? Let's see what that looks like. Let's see what this looks like. Uh, okay. Yeah, 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 I like that. See how it gives it a little more dimension? Uh, yeah, that looks a lot cooler. I probably could have did with one less brick right up there, but I think it's okay. I think that is okay. So let me do the same thing on this other side. Uh, hopefully the measurements are the same. <laughs> so I'm going to do that real quick, and then I'll check back in with you guys. Alright guys, we're getting there. I added a little greenery in there uh, for spawn proofing, of course, and just, I don't know, more decoration, a little more color to add to the build. Um, but now what I have to do is kind of replicate what I did here in the front uh, with this cobblestone and iron fence here. And I want to replicate that all the way around the rest of the uh, structure. So uh, I'm going to do that real quick. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to hop in here like so. And uh, yeah, got some... Uh, <laughs> this is my mining area. I'll probably close this back off. Uh, eventually, and then this will be like the main entrance in and out of the, uh, oh, you're not welcome here, creeper. Go away. Go away. There. Did I get him? 
I don't know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is probably going to be the main entrance into this farm. Uh, but this is like my little cheat way in <laughs> right now. So uh, eventually, I'll put uh, I'll put the uh, the furnace in and then the cobblestone back in there as well. But uh, I need to get some more stone brick here. Oh, I only have 15 on me, so I'll have to go get some more. But um, yeah, so then we're going to do the same thing we did um, with this one. Um, it's on the back, so then right here will be where we're going to put some stone brick here to kind of bring it in, just like we did with the other one. Uh, like so and like that and then so every two spaces one two we're gonna have more iron bars here oh and I'm out of iron bars right now <laughs> so I need to get some of those too but anyways that's what I'm gonna do next guys uh, when I get that finished uh, I'll check back in with you guys all right guys I uh, got it all finished all the way around as you can see, I just kind of repeated what I did in the front. I got the uh, stone bricks right there, followed by the stone fence, cobblestone wall, rather. Uh, and then, of course, the iron bars. And I did that all the way around the entire structure. Here's our entrance. And, uh, yeah, things are, things are coming together here, guys. Things are coming together here. I'm a little concerned about this cobblestone wall here how it just kind of hangs in there I wonder if I if I bring something if I bring this down some let me just see real quick if this, this is gonna look weird or or what oh and then yeah I put slabs in <laughs> that's why I can't put my uh, my uh, scaffolding down is because I got I got slabs up here I put slabs inside here uh, for spawn proofing so yeah if you put the if you put a bottom bottom slab in then uh, monsters won't be able to spawn on the slab. Of course, that means when I go to make scaffolding, I have to uh, add a slab to the slab. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, that's, this is where I want to bring the, uh, the the cobblestone wall down, like so. I don't know if this is going to look weird in here or if it'll be okay. But, uh, oh yeah, and then we probably need to bring up that and do something like that. I think that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. That'll work. Cool. So yeah, that's the next little thing that I'm going to do here, guys. And uh, I like how this looks inside. I really do like how this looks in the inside here, guys. But uh, yeah, I'm going to do that and uh, we'll see where we go from there. All right, guys. The big reveal <laughs> is here. Uh, it's finished. The inside is finished. The outside is finished. Let me show you what we got here. I did a little, a little flexing here. I got a, got a little iron. These are iron uh, blocks, my friends. This is solid iron blocks and an iron bridge all the way over here. Got my lanterns made of iron <laughs> right here. And then when I got here to the uh, farming area, the little garden area, I changed to glass. Uh, that way, uh, the sunlight can still get to the plants so they can grow. And then, yeah, and then that's what we got. I did take out the uh, the cobblestone walls that I was using, and I put in some oak wood planks just to give it a little more added color. It was looking a little too gray. Still looks maybe a little too gray, but this this helps it a lot <laughs> a lot more and I actually turned this into the main entrance to the area now I was gonna like close this off but this is the way up and down to the farm top of the farm and then this is inside the farm and then in here we got our furnaces stacked up here I don't know that I'm ever gonna have stuff to uh, to, 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 to furnace <laughs> here <laughs> but oh, I thought it looked cool got the crafting tables on either side and of course like a little mantle thing almost looks like a, a fireplace but uh, with doors in it instead <laughs> and of course the uh, floor is made out of uh, cobblestone slabs bottom slabs so that uh, mobs will not be able to spawn in here and then yeah right here the cobblestone walls that I was putting in in that last clip just like that went around and uh, and did that the whole way around and yeah see I, I basically replaced the uh, cobblestone walls that was here 
with uh, with the oak wood planks just to make it, you know, just uh, make it a little little a little nicer, make it a little more colorful from the outside. And of course, right here is the uh, uh, the side entrance, and I got a little like a little walkway here that leads back to the uh, the main entrance right there, and then of course down here, just like that we got all the supports in guys in fact I even went so far as to add supports to this little structure here I was gonna take this out it was you know originally it was the uh, the my village breeder <laughs> this is where I used the, this is where I bred the villagers that went up there eventually um, and I was just gonna tear it down but I've since um, uh, repurposed it <laughs> I guess we can say so uh, if we go inside here just like so like that yeah I decorated it up a little bit and it's become kind of my my iron farm storage area there's just all sorts of bits and pieces mostly stuff for the build here uh, that we'll probably still use um, and then this is the iron chest right here <laughs> it's got all the iron that I've collected so far well minus the uh, the iron the blocks of iron that I used for the road there and of course there's a bed here so uh, yeah guys that is it man we got it finished uh, didn't do quite as much as I wanted to get done um, but maybe we can uh, do a little bit more in the next episode uh, in the next episode uh, we'll probably work on the top portion of the uh, this farm a little bit and uh, try to get that squared away so that's what we're going to do in the next episode guys hey thanks for watching man if you enjoyed this video be sure to like subscribe if you haven't subscribed man and just i appreciate all the uh you know support you guys give and please comment i love the comments man the comments keep me going let me know that you're watching let me know what your favorite part of the video was i mean just get let me know man give me some feedback that really helps me to keep moving guys anyways this is vp i am signing off see you later and hey Keep on gaming!